finish that one off just fine and take command. We can take a star base with actually no four destroyers is actually iffy on that front. They actually managed to sneak. I think we better get a cruiser back, uh, get the micro cruiser in. Now we'll just reconvene the forces next turn. Well, we've got to take this thing out too, so. Get ready to apply the brakes to these little speed demons. Stop. There we go. Excellent. Piece of cake. Come on. It spends a little too much time on this post-combat part for uh, fights that I was actually directly involved in. Is this one generating pollution? It's not, but it's also not losing pollution. So I think we better scoot an atmospheric uh, renewer into the queue early. <sighs> Actually, we'll just buy that right now. Just get that done. Alright, so with the current circumstance, I believe the Mechlar have officially been... Except for the tech, which they're kind of roaring up on, as are the... I suppose I could just wipe out the Mechlar, but... Let's see, I think once they're down to a few more planets, we'll be able to uh, more or less put the brakes on their development. Let's see... We want that one, but we also want Mechlon Prime, because that is a good, solid planet right there. It's also in a very good location. I suppose we could use leave Glee. If I get rid of these three worlds here... That's a rich world. Eh, at some point I've just got to... Um, Stand back and let the uh, end come for them, but... <sighs> Alrighty. So, one... Okay, Fleet A, you get out of there. Fleet B, just blow it up. Onwards. Actually, I gotta be a little careful about not getting flanked at this stage. Okay. This is a fleet that has beaten a starbase before. So as soon as the destroyers start firing off their rockets, we will put the brakes on. Ah, missiles. So awesome. Excellent. Alright, one good hit. hits to get through the armor, and one more hit should do it. Or shields, I should say. 
I guess this is going to be a two-parter. I'm having a lot of fun here tonight. There we go. And then we say goodbye to the Mechlar world. survived. Barely, but it survived. Impressive. Where their capitals moved to now, it's definitely, uh, definitely relocated further down the line, hasn't it? All right, I think the Mechlar are pretty close to being broken. Bolrathi Trade Treaty. What is it you want? I just Speak want to plainly. set up a trade treaty so that I have my awesome economy. We would advise. Oh, yeah, get over it. I just want their money. Okay, 9 of 14. It's now a Terran world, which is good. Let's get one of those, one of those, and then let's get some uh, civil transports or colony ships. What's it going to be? Let's get a, few, a couple civil transports, a couple colony ships, actually, and then the Soil Enrichment Center near the end. That's the end of that. Another one bites the dust. Alright, you back to Nero 2. You through to Phoenix. You. No, we want to claim the Tetch's system. If we're only going to complain one, claim one. This four abundant worlds. We'll start by claiming this uh, lovely Terran world here. Over Mechlon Prime? Yeah, I think so. Oh, wow. I wonder how long that's been in the queue for. Forever and a day, probably. I think it's just going to chill out here. It's going to be needed in... We're going to need the uh, fleets in new locations soon. Okay, I think the um, war against the Mechlon is coming up to a close here. We've got a nice arm of colonization well into their territory. We are going to have a hold on the Orion system, which will be very useful to us. Okay. It'd be nice if they would match speeds properly, but... Okay. And stop. Well out of range of their... Uh, the extra weapons that those star bases have. Oh. You guys actually might need to pull back. that actually you guys oh well okay we're okay good stuff that colony that's enough to get rid of that one excellent okay well with that under control my bomber fleet can start heading back towards colonized worlds That is a big fleet there. That is their core fleet, isn't it? Wait, hold on. Oh, never mind. It's not their core fleet. That's just one ship. One one cruiser orbiting a well-defended planet. That's important. Must have just been built. Okay, well. 
we will continue our work towards ending. Let us trade. Um, do I want to open borders with the uh, hostile Bolrathi who are at war with somebody? Uh, let's let the Bolrathi through. They can go through. I think they're going after the Clacon anyways, so... We'll just need to make sure that we are in a position to get rid of the Bulrathi ships when they eventually, um... Ah, yes. This one. Let's get some growth going here. And then we'll decide what to do from there. This one. Another world. In memory of the lost Zarkon society, we'll colonize on the graveyard of their world. Because why not? Skip this turn with you. All right. Mm, how are we doing? Okay, the Mechla are still on track for science. We're on track for, ironically enough, conquest of all things. Bulrathi, we could uh, catch up with the Bulrathi economically pretty quick here. Let's see, that's an ultra-rich. Okay, this is a good star system. I think it's got to go. With the usual methodology of go this way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Pull back, pull back. You're going the wrong way. Alright, good. Now that we're doing it right. We've got those lovely energy shots from our battleship. And it's going to start shooting rockets pretty quick too. There we go. Yeah. Keep going. There we go. That is definitely getting stuck. Everybody take your shots at me. That's not going to last long. Nope, not even a little. Okay. I'm just going to start keep blowing up planets. I wonder how quickly I could get that second population point here. So that it could start making, um... Even the interesting and useful thing is, even if they manage to, um... recolonize, they're still gonna have to rebuild, too. So I think I'm going to just say, who cares about this... Other than actually getting eyes on the worlds, and we'll see how we feel. You guys go join him. You're only a few turns away from uh, being awesome. You.
you need to start building a military outpost on the border. It's another cruiser there. Got a couple troop transports queued up, and then I think we're going to queue up a uh, battleship as well. And that's because um, I'm getting concerned about the... Uh, well, I've got to figure out what our next uh, military move is. And more importantly, how we might consider uh, winning this... Uh, war we've... these wars we've picked out. Who else needs orders? You need orders. Where are you gonna go? Yeah, maybe you can build one on that border too. Okay. Only two turns left on astral construction. Gonna give us access to the Titan. So our big fleets need to reconvene in a position where they can then this is GNN. Population has boomed in a human colony as the population growth rate has doubled for unknown reasons. That's a pretty big uh, increase in growth rate. Okay. First troop transport just came off the line for a very long time. All right, well, this one needs pollution controls. So we'll start by cleanup, processor, renewer, toxic, marine barracks. That's a star system that's definitely waiting for more uh, additions. All right. Oh, a star base is back, huh? Well, he's definitely burning through his coin, isn't he? Those colony ships are just roaring around. Oh, he's coming after uh, Mechlon, isn't he? I'll bet you he's coming after Mechlon Prime. Well, this fleet can come down there and take care of that issue. All right, troop transports, we're going to want those actually um, in the neighborhood of Proculus and uh, Orbis, because those are two I'm actually thinking I'm going to want to conquer. All right, take command, we're going in, as usual. Now it's just a star base, so... All right. So this crew is going to get there first. They're actually um, and you just need to go a little further. There we go. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Strong point defenses. I'm not even sure which weapon is actually dealing with those missiles. Missile defenses of some sort. Very effective. Okay. Okay. One more turn of that should do it. Maybe two. Oh, five destroyers. Oh, excellent. That's something we definitely need. Little, uh... I'm not sure who we're going to war with next. I'm going to definitely have to give that some thought. But we do have to spend a couple seconds on our destroyers because they are not up to date. Can we afford any of these? Not really. Oh dear. Oh, hold on. What kind of... You know what? Oh, dear. My, uh... 
little one is uh, decided to freak out. So three of those, perfect. Perfect. Now for the bomber. And they're already using antimatter bombs, but I believe... Nope, can't fit more. Could fit another laser. Could fit two more. Nope, just one more laser. Okay. Done. Alright. Onwards. And we're going to get Astro Construction. Alright. Welcome oh. to GNN. Galactic oh, News. Goodbye, Network. Alkari. The Garlock Cabal battle against the Alkari Flock for control of the galaxy. Alright, well. <sighs> that's mostly the Darlocks saying, yeah, we're gonna kick their butts into the Stone Age. Or completely out of existence, even. Alright, research. Our scientists have made a new discovery. Welcome aboard, Titan. Just a minute of your time, mm, President. No. No, 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 no. Oh, what do we have here? Core waste dump or deep core mine? That's another that's another big gum. Um, Production. Plus two production per cell. Fantastic. That's exactly what we need to boost our uh, manufacturing economy. Alright. You're just a rich world. I want to wish... Okay, so these will not affect exported productivity. Which is good, important, important information. Let's do it this way. Let's get a atmospheric renewer and a pollution processor, and then we're going to terraform this world. Now, the world that's going to get the uh, administration is this one right here. Planetary Administration, Robo Miners, Spaceport, Space Elevator. Alright, another troop transport to Zine Prime. Cruiser to there. Destroyers to there as well. Alright, who needs orders? You need orders. Ah, three structures left on Phoenix Prime. Nope, there's another troop transport. All right, we're on our way now. I'm starting to build people. Now, I would really much rather, you know, as much as the Darlocks are annoying me, I think I'm going to have to take on the, um... Oh, never mind. We're getting up there in the economic victory. We're also... Starting to come up the tech tree a bit. I think the Bulrathi being our closest rivals now in almost everything. Yeah, I do believe they're going to be our target. So we better start sending these fleets down the uh, other line. Because we'll just convince everybody to go to war with the, the Bulrathi as well, I guess. It'd be funny if we could even talk the if we could talk the Mechlar into it too. That would be pretty hysterical. All right, our new world, Tetchis Three. Welcome. All right, factory, biospheres, collider, laboratory, money. Terran world is going to grow pretty fast, which means it's going to have some pretty nice. Uh, productivity going on. Okay, this one has got some pretty serious financial issues. 
18 credits being lost here because we do not have enough population. The only way to get more population would be to actually build population, or we could just boost boost it through a bit of terraforming. It's 30 turns tied up terraforming, but I think it's going to be well worth it. There we are. Another one bites the dust. Here comes that uh, colony ship I was waiting for. Okay, take command of this one. I'm going to just speed this up a little. Getting ready to put the brakes on our ships as soon as they start shooting. Excellent. Well, that worked out well. Wait, hardly even, uh, we hardly even broke a sweat on that one. Okay. Colony ship. Neclon Prime. None of these people are going to be terribly happy with me about what I've been doing. Alright, so down to the primary Bulgarathi border, which is N... Ensis. Okay, what do we have here? We have a couple more ultra-rich worlds. That's actually a pretty good one. But I'm pretty sure we've hit the uh, end of uh, Mechlar um, Ascendancy. Whoa. All right, stop, stop, stop. 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 Take the shields down. Just basically overwhelming it with the number of missiles we can shoot at it. It's... yeah. Fixed emplacements? Not a problem. We can take them down. No worries. <sighs> and another one bites the dust. this stage, I don't even really care that, uh... How many, uh... It's four space factories. That's a pretty big hit on their, uh, functional economy. Alright. Fleet... Next, the next fleet is gonna start gathering. Just hope we're rid of these uh, dar darlocks. Grant me this potentate ah, that we may learn from your office. Sure, why not? You're not a threat to me. Heed my warning, interloper. You're going to be uh, my next uh, next one in my um, targets. Darlock and Clackons, huh? Have your say. Trade treaty. Without prison. And Clackons. Our tendrils. Trade treaty. Goodbye. Heed yeah, my yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. So much complaining. I mean, seriously, dude. All right. Where is this one, anyways? Oh, way out there, okay. Let's get colonies. Excellent. A couple colony ships on the way from you. You have built the core 
economy here. Alright, and then some more growth in there. Alright, guys. I'm going to see... What's left to do here? Two cruisers, huh? You know what? I think we could just call uh, our Mechlar War done as soon as we have control of Mechlon. So I think we could actually contemplate just uh, pulling a. Well. Let's see, how many worlds are they down to? One, two, three, four, five, split amongst various star systems. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's head her back. We don't really need to pick too many more fights with the mech, with the, uh, with these guys, so. All right, everyone. Well, I think that's a wrap for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. It's been quite the um, adventure. Just sneak this in here while I'm thinking about it. Because, uh... Wow. Did I not build the, um... Well, I guess I did. Wow, I guess it's just that bad. We'll see if that helps enough. Um, yeah, that's a wrap, guys. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye for now.